Yo, what is up with it? Who says that? That's a scar. I think it's a bunch of people. That is a bunch of people. We're talking about codename kids next door, and which in yeah. which guy we are. Yeah, explaining which ones are which to uh the Theodore here. You're yeah. two. No, Patty's. No, I'm one. You are one. Patty's two. Nobody's five. No, Patty's like father or something. Oh, uh, what the fuck? Yeah, Ted, the Ted's got the knowledge. I want to be. The, I want to yeah. be collectively the delightful children from the <laughs> I secretly watched a codename kid next door lore video recently. That's tight. So. <laughs> I love your new. Well, I think you've probably always been like this, but the, taking the YouTube deep dives and just bolt and just the dumb shit. Oh yeah, it's so yeah, fun. Yeah, yeah. I love doing that. That's so weird because like an hour or two, we are having this conversation. Or we're talking about how. It alternates between one being in charge and five being in charge, and and, and then two to four to three. Yeah, well, yeah. Because and then and Ted just like, I no, think that's I'm, what number, he means. I'm number four because there's four of us, <laughs> <laughs> and I do the least. Well, I just didn't understand that you guys were talking about code name kids next door. Uh-huh. I never made that connection. It's because I'm stupid. It's okay. No, you're just high. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, maybe. I always like the the old acronyms they do, huh? Uh, no, what do you mean? Like, oh, uh, like for the the weapons and shit. Yeah, yeah, those are fun. They do like amp Austin Melee podcast two by four technology. This one is yeah, oh. we're on episode three of season whatever the fuck this is four season four. Yeah, the fifth season. The oh. fifth season. <laughs> it also we had three point five, which is <laughs> the sixth season. It could be kind of. <laughs> <laughs> we don't know. We we were gone for the past two weeks because I was traveling and Patty's also not here, and a two person podcast. No one would do that. We should have done. We shouldn't have because nobody wants to set nah. that shit up. No. Nah. I feel like me and you sitting down and talking about something would be fun, though. Yeah, probably. We, we, we like things. Oh, we, could, we could do a movie episode. We, we could, could do, do a, a movie surprise episode. movie episode. We, we could both, watch like, a movie together like, and then film. talk about it. Yeah. That would be cute. That would be cute. But we have our two-person podcast, which I was trying to joke about. We, we do. We, 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 Nobody we, likes that one. Sorry, we're, we're trying not. to outshine it over here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it won't be too hard. I mean... <laughs> uh. Uh, there's no uh, no episodes to upload but whatever well anyway what are we gonna be the uh filmography flunkies the filmography (laughs) that sounds gay (laughs) derogatory Uh, derogatory. (laughs) um what would we be the the film friends film friends is cute (laughs) but it's Uh, well, we got a discog. So it'd be Phil like Ma, Phil, 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 Phil Mog, friends. friends. Mm. Wait, what? What's the um? Uh, what's the website people use? Letterbox. How about Letterbox Leopard? Now I'm trying to distance <laughs> myself from Letterbox these days. You you, you dis- you like Letterbox? No, I just. <sighs> You don't like the idea, the function of letterbox. No, I just don't like people who say the words letterbox. Oh, <laughs> the other day, like mailmen, you really, you really hate mailmen. I was so bored at work like four months ago that I made a letterbox uh, and just went through a bunch of movies and like this, that, that, and I just gave them star reviews. I didn't like write. Do you give any zero them. or five stars? I gave five stars to my favorite ones, and I don't uh, think I went. At- oh, I gave one zero star to the worst film I've ever seen to this day. Okay, which is uh. Disney's John Carter of Mars, okay. which I saw in theaters when it came out. And even as a dumb, like, freshman in high school, I thought it was the worst piece of shit movie I've ever seen in my life. Hmm. But it was funny, at least. Dude, fucking uh, Adam in the chat just said, movie mans. The movie man. <laughs> which is really good. <laughs> Hi, that guy. Um, cool. What's up, everyone? What's what's the deal? You were away. You are doing away. business. Business. You watched a lot of Marvel movies. I did. I watched a bunch of FX. Uh, Which lots, apparently only plays Marvel movies. Lots of Marvel, lots of X-Men. Hmm. Um, I watched Con Air. Oh, Nick Cage. We love Con Air. Still haven't seen that. 
I haven't either. I just know you Nick Cage. I thought you would have seen it. Oh, we're watching. It's Con on Air. my list. We're watching Con Air. It was, didn't we put it on the list? It's been on my list, and then we put it on our list as okay. well. Dude, yeah. Con Air is fucking awesome. Speaking of which, we need to watch a family movie. Con Air's first. Dibs. Do you, you just watched it, though. I, I want to see it again. <laughs> <laughs> I've never seen it. Wow. It must be pretty good. It's you know, also long. Well, with commercials, it's very long. But <laughs> I've never seen Face Off. You ever see Face Off? I don't even know what that is. Uh, it's another Nick Cage movie. It's by the dude who... He's a he's a director from China, I want to say. And he makes a lot of, like, kind of ultra-violent, like, showy uh, action films. Like he did Poly- Tarantino. I think Hong Kong is one of his movies. Yeah. I'm pretty sure. Uh, he made... He did um, Mission Impossible 2, which is the worst Mission Impossible movie. Uh, Face Off. Um, I think, like... I don't know. He, oh, make, he makes fun movies. But we should watch Face Off because everyone's like, Face Off is tight. We will watch Face Off. We should watch it. I, sure. think, I think two jet boats like collide in the air at one point in Face Off. Spoiler alert. Sounds tight. God. Jet <laughs> boat. <Ruined. laughs> uh, you know I live for my jet boat collisions. But yes, I watched a bunch of movies. I had a good time in Gaithersburg, Maryland. Um, I would have gone out and like did some melee stuff, but... Uh, I was just too busy with work, unfortunately. Dang. I had I had I had previous work I was doing, and it was just like, I can't hit up Zane the hangout. Um, mm-hmm. I'm t- I'm too busy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's the problem. Here. Big guy in town here. Yeah, I'm yeah. I'm just too busy. Yeah. Or you've been up to Ted just working. Yeah, I've just been hanging out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, I'm not gonna be here next week though. What? I'm going to. The Genesis of Rednecks, Whoa. also known as the Indianapolis 500. So that would be pretty fun. Mm, you're going to yeah. watch him turn left? Right? Yeah. yeah. Okay, that, that's the, the... Who did that joke? Counterclockwise. Yeah. yeah that's um, like uh, a thing that people say. Sounds fun. Yeah. <laughs> well, well, uh, who, who's the group? What are you going with? Who are you going with? Uh, it's just me and uh, our future roommate, Huey. Huey! And um, that's it. We're Tight. just going to go out there and uh, just camp out. Bars. Just a couple bros, get a weekend of camping and drinking Dude. beer skis and uh, watching cars go fast. I need to see the fucking fits. Oh, we're <laughs> redneck cosplay. <laughs> I'm, I'm like, so excited. I'm pretty sure I'm going like <laughs> real short, short jorts with the work boots with like some real tree Let's and go. just like, you know, my Bass Pro Shop hat. Like, I'm just going to dive into the, the yeah. redneck culture. I want you to be in a position somehow where one, something happens to one of the drivers and you're so close to like, you get in the car. <laughs> I'm gonna be lining up on the pit. <laughs> Are you guys flying down or driving? Uh, we're flying to Chicago and then driving from there. I forgot Chicago's in Indiana. What a piece of shit state. In Illinois. Illinois. My bad. Fuck. But man. Right there. Yes. They all make sense. Yeah. It's like three hours away, but we're gonna rent a truck and drive down. A truck too. Oh yeah. Oh. Good. <laughs> <That's tight. laughs> we're going camping. I mean. Oh, are, so it is a camping trip. Yeah. yeah well. T- you, t- like tailgating kind of thing? Or? Yeah. yeah. You Dude, camp, like, that's all fun. weekend. Yeah, that sounds tight. Yeah. Are you going to drop acid like, while you're there? So I guess it's like Genesis and Smash Camp of Redneck. Oh, Redneck. Okay. Yeah. Best of both worlds. Yeah, kind of like you a best of both worlds. You get the camping aspect and you get that everyone's going to be there. Exactly. It, yeah. It's Smash Camp, but if it was a super spreader event. Yes, 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 yes. I see. Mm-hmm. Very yeah, cool. Yeah, we're going to be spreading. Um, Do you have a favorite guy? Oh yeah, I'm looking. Uh, I'm really cheering for uh, Takuma Sato. I've been watching a lot of, you know. God bless you. He's uh, <laughs> one of the only Japanese drivers in the field. He's real exciting to watch. That's um, tight. I've been enjoying his racing. He's a three-time winner. He's you know established. Okay, okay. Yeah. The Armada of. No, I mean, there's also there's a bunch of there's there's a few you know ring Hitters. ring bears in the in the field. Okay. What do you win? You get a, you get the cup or you get a trophy, the right? Berg Warner Trophy. Gotcha. Uh, not, yeah. not not the uh, Piston Cup. Not the Piston Cup. <sighs> That's from- you also get to drink the milk. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> None of their weird traditions. It's kind of uh, all of watermelon in New England melee. Uh huh. Yeah, the, the, the victory melon. Yeah, it's the victory jug of milk. Oh, I don't like that at all. No, it's really gross, and they like. Pour it on oh, themselves a lot of time, and it's like hot. It's and they're Memorial sweaty. Yeah. yeah, that sounds gross. Is it from like the victory cow? Like, what? How do you? What determines the oh, middle? Oh, Bessie, the victory cow. <laughs> yeah. Oh, so they all get to choose what kind of milk they would want if they would win before the race, That's and then wild. they have those milks prepared in case they win. So it's like, it's like in CEO, you have your intro song. 
to top eight, mm-hmm. and they're mm-hmm. like, "I mm-hmm. want my milk of choice, my celebratory milk, they my milk, milk. The, the milk I'm going to bathe in once I." <laughs> That's crazy. Win. Uh huh. And uh, yeah, so people have all sorts of choices. And there's this one dude, this one like Italian dude in the '90s, uh, Emerson Fittipaldi. Uh-huh. Um, he drank uh, like orange juice. He's like, "Now nah, fuck the milk." He's like, "Give me orange juice." That's and tight. everybody was all like huffy about everything. Of course, like, eh, this guy. Oh, can you imagine being mad about that? That's crazy. It's not <laughs> only the small things that that if you if you they're so fucking stupid. But in the face of tradition, if you change one little thing, people will fucking have a hissy fit oh, yeah. over it. It's so wild. I mean, it's been going on since like 1905 yeah. or some bullshit like that. It's like when um when Daniel Craig was announced to be the next Bond, uh-huh. everyone oh, was pissed because yeah. he's blonde. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and Bond should be blonde, and everyone was fucking mad. And then he was like the best Bond. <laughs> yeah, <ever>. easily. <laughs> it's so funny. That rules. Uh, uh-huh. What? Yeah. That's fucking. That's tight. Um, it's gonna be fun. So how so the whole fucking week? So I'm leaving Thursday, but I have to leave early Thursday, so I'm probably not gonna pod Wednesday evening before okay. that. No worries. Well, that's weird. If my my tweet I made it's like we'll be back forever and ever and ever. We won't be back next week. So we need a guy. get oh, guest star. Sure. I mean, I guess we could. Yeah, we'll look into it. Sure. You should get. Oh, I was gonna say Patty. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get new Patty. <laughs> new Patty. Build a robot. New Patty. Build a robo Patty. Build a robo Patty. Let's get a soundboard. Where, where are the dabs? <laughs> <laughs> that was a pretty good Bur- robo Patty. Burger King. <laughs> Dude, he fucking. We had this whole thing last time we did a podcast where it's like, oh, you know, where's the camera? Patty had the camera the whole time. Mm-hmm. Patty, send us the camera so we can have all the. So we can get rid of the Ryan corner. But. He didn't do it. Didn't yeah. fucking do Motherfucking it. Motherfucking Patty. God damn it. Pretty typical. Yeah. We'll be hearing from him later. We have a little Patty segment. Yeah. Uh, I wonder if the camera's going to be involved. I don't know. We didn't, we didn't screen it that much. Yeah. But I do know what the topic is this time, so we're not going to spend a whole, like, 20 minutes talking about something and then have Patty say the same thing directly right that after That was very us. funny. It was funny, Um, but we won't do that again. Nice. Isn't that cool? It's thick, man. If you insist. I guess I do, don't I? Okay, okay, okay. Uh, I wanted to talk about the big old smash event that went down, Summit, mm. this past weekend. Mm. What do you think about it? A uh, couple, couple points. Sure. First off, it was Survivor Summit, and I want to ask you guys if you've ever watched Survivor, and if you're more of a Boston Rob or a Russell guy. I still fucking Boston like Rob, that baby. I love Boston Rob. I've never watched a single minute of Survivor. I also watched life. Boston Rob on The Amazing Race when he was on. Oh yeah, on that. He met his wife on Survivor, Mike. Cool. Isn't that great? And That's they're still great. together, I think. Yeah. Boston Rob. Boston Rob always wearing the Red Sox hat. Yeah, that's right. His Come name's, on, his name's Rob. You must like Boston Rob. <laughs> love him. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, Boston Rob. <laughs> Boston Rob. What about when Ken won? He didn't. He didn't win. Come on, guys. <laughs> <laughs> yes, man. Ken got like third or like fourth or something. Did he actually make it that far? Yep. If I'm watching Survivor and I see this fucking guy on my team, I don't know anything about Survivor. He's got uh-huh. mind games, though. Does he? Have you ever seen the games. Ken mind games? Well, all, all melee back then was mind games, Mike. Yeah. Sure, because nobody knew how to see stick. Yeah, Ken didn't have any tech skill. All he had was mind games. <laughs> That's all I it was. I'm a mind <laughs> wizard. I have like a weird memory of like watching Ken's season when I was a little boy mm-hmm. with my family, and like them showing a clip of him playing brawl, mm. like him playing like I think Marth Rob on Halibird or something like that. Huh. That's funny. I mean, and. I thought he was a professional brawl player until, you know, until I found out he was. Until I figured out he invented the reverse snow wiener. Dude. Until you saw, and then he will try. And then he will that, try. That wasn't Ken, though. No. No, but. But you're saying the doc. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. And then you see Ken. But, um, uh, yeah, Boston Rob rules. <laughs> anyway, <Boston. Survivor> Summit. <laughs> Moral of the story Boston, Boston Rob <laughs> rules. Yeah, we love him. <laughs> Uh, wait. So, what was Survivor Summit? What What did they so do like, that was different? It was basically Summit. If everyone got COVID, that wasn't the theme, but that's what happened. Uh, there was a bunch of people got COVID, oh. and they had to like 
let's move things around. The staff did a really good job at like changing it up and make, yep. ma- making sure like mm-hmm. things were good. Cool. People getting tested. But definitely uh definitely a weird one yeah. as far as uh Fake that goes. But just kidding. On the survivor aspect of it, they said a bunch of like goofy little challenges. And they did a they did puzzles? a single crew battle, singles crew battle, they did a doubles crew battle. Mm. Uh which was interesting and cool. Mango mm. and, and salt uh kind of swept. Cool. They did a sick job. That's tight. Um and a bunch of other stuff. Like, for example, um they played Bop It. Oh, they had a little bop it competition. That. That's funny. And here's the thing about bop it, right? So H box mips at a mic, talking that good shit. Mm-hmm. Bop about it. his bop it skills. He's like, dude, I won my school's competition, like for bop it. When oh. I was, fuck is a bop it when I was a youth. Uh, the highest score, Mike. Oh, because yeah, it's a you play against yourself. Bop, yeah, bop. yeah, yeah. Okay, I forgot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. But it like counts. It gives you a that. number. Maybe, maybe, maybe it was a passing thing, but he. It sounded like he like could just do it forever. Sure. Like he's like, guys, I'm a Bop It King. I got this, no problem. Pause. Yeah. What's your favorite thing to do on a Bop It? Like, what's your favorite task? Oh, I I, I don't really play Bop It. I like twist it. I, I like. No, I don't it. like twist. I, I like spin it more than twist pull it. Pull it. I like pull, pull it is one of them. Pull it. Pull it. Just pull it. Bop it. Twi- twist. I it, gotta say, and flick it, and also spin it. I oh, do. Flick it tight. I do like to bop it. Yeah, yeah. It is, it is <laughs> I gotta say. You bop it, everyone cheers. And you go, <laughs> bop. Oh, okay. And they did that for a reason. <laughs> Boop. You can do it stylishly. Boop. Bop. Hit that shit with your head. Tongue. Hit it on the ground. Yeah. Hit on Hunger Box's it. head. <laughs> Pull them up. Everyone playing bop it, not that good at bop it. Lots of low scores in bop it. How do you get a low score on How'd the box it? do? That's what I want to know. know. Box got like 80 That's something. That's fucking crazy. 80 something. But someone, guy's but someone did better. Wait, so he? Fucked. Oh, geez. So these two pulled away with it, is what you're telling me? Yes. H box of all the confidence in the world got like 80 or something. Mm-hmm. But who beats him? But the task god himself. Is Plop. He? Uh, Plop gets like 160. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Jesus. How much time of straight bopping it? It was it? a while. That seems like whizzy stuff. Yeah, I could. Boise well, wasn't there, so yeah, yeah. he couldn't. Florida. Yeah, but but Plop, Plop's insane. So yeah, why are these Floridians good at bop it? That's all they have to do. I can't I, go outside I'm just, or the. I'm just assuming Wizrobe's nasty, yeah. and then mm. three of them are just the holy I, trinity of bop it players. I'm, I'm sure it. they are. Yeah. The Triforce of bop it. <laughs> yeah, you can't go outside because of all the snakes and alligators, so you have to stay inside. And it's bop it all it's funny you say that, Mike, because actually bop it's one thing that scares the alligators away from you. Bop it, and so they go, "Oh fuck!" It's like it's like how you make the uh, the circle for the uh, sea bears. Yeah, mm. yeah. So if an alligator attacks you, pull your bop it, and you start going. And it's like that. He's too skillful. Oh fuck! I mean, I, I got. I couldn't do that. <laughs> Book it. I also don't like being bopped. I'm gonna bop it. Bop. I love the idea that the serpentine maneuver works on alligators and crocodiles. Yeah. Just because they can't fucking turn fast enough or whatever. Mm-hmm. That's funny to me. Yeah. Idiots. So stupid. Fool. Dinosaur ass animal. Yeah. Fuck you. I, I feel like. It depends how tight your serpentine is, though. How I mean, how good are you at serpentine? Well, if it's too tight, then you're just going in a straight line. That's what I mean. Yeah, so you well, gotta go like this. And the, there's like the, optimal like angles and like. I want to know zigzag. though. That should be an Olympic sport. I'm curious. <laughs> Run away from the crocodile. I want to see Mike's best serpentine. I bet it's I'd awful. get fucking eaten immediately. No, Mike's falling. Mike is. I trip over my fucking ankles. Yeah. Mike's like, like, now we turn left. And then <laughs> slip on a banana peel. And then it goes, well, oh. <laughs> and then they do the fucking roll. The <laughs> roll. <laughs> ah. Uh, cool beans. What else about the summit? Is the is the dang jang? Ah, uh, I mean, uh, J Mook beat a bunch of ass. He he mm, is good. Yeah. Law beat a bunch Herm. of ass. Law beat Leffen in pu- in a uh, peach fall. Kind of beat his ass. Three O to Leffen. It was the first time Leffen's got 3 0 by Peach since 2014. Jesus. Um, and that's 3 0. I'm sure would be even like losing to a Peach is, man. you know, like. Few and far between. I mean, yeah, I... competing in the EU must be so hard. <laughs> wait, wait. He complained about the reg- uh, his region. And also today, I think he tweeted that uh, his L trigger wasn't working the whole weekend. It's always fucking sad. It's like, yeah, yeah. I fucking hate this insane. guy. Insane. I don't know. <laughs> it's funny, too, because, like, if you're complaining about competition and losing to Lod, it's like, dude, literally the second best Peach player is 
from Spain, like Triff. Yeah. Like that's the yeah. other really good peach. That's the guy. Like yeah. and <laughs> oh. I don't know. Whatever. He has a dog. It, but anyway, he has something more important than a dog too. A a wife. Are they are they married? No. A no, GameCube controller? Okay. No. He has the C9 Coke mirror. And sure. I want it. Do you want the C9 Coke mirror? This is going to be your uh, Hax's box yes, scenario. It is. It yeah. is. So, uh, Mango held a 0. .5 for Summit this, this year, like, mm-hmm. like most years. Mm-hmm. And But instead of doing it at his house, they did the C9 like gamer lounge. The compound. Oh. Yeah. yeah. So, it was like decked out. They like host everybody. You know, it was very cool. I think Mango wants to use that space a lot more. And like it's mm-hmm. it was sick. And one thing they did was on the last day, they had a two stock tournament, single elimination mm-hmm. of everyone there. And the winner got this trophy that's like like an octagon, I think, or hexagon. Something. Mirror with C9 on it. And it looks like a Coke mirror. Mm-hmm. It's like, it is such a fucking Coke mirror. It's insane. I believe you. Yeah. I, I, I have the picture saved. Um, I believe uh, Ringler made an edit of it. He did. Um, that put good. Coke on it. You should pass it over to Ted. Nice. That so, is a good Coke mirror. Like yeah, so we need that. We, we need to get that. How, I thought we are doing Coke. How are we getting, but we want the Coke mirror. No, just an accessory. Yeah. Um, Dang it. How do, we, how, do yeah. we, how do we swindle this Coke mirror from Leffen? What's the next thing Leffen's going to be at? Well, we make sure we all got passports and that are up to date first. Good point. Uh-huh. Step, step one. <laughs> and, a, our and, a big, <laughs> and a big trench coat. <laughs> yeah, we and we'll need a... sit on each other's shoulders <laughs> yep. and then go up to his house. We're going to need some good sweaters, too, to Ooh. brave those north Norse winds. Correct. So we, we can be like snake oil salesmen, but we're like, we have the perfect controller in here. Yeah. And then we throw him in a bag. Him. He's kind of tall. Yeah, and then we he run is, in really? and get it might the be, Yeah, he's like 6'2 or something. Well, we're all going to be on each other's shoulders, so we're going to be like oh, 10 way feet tall. <laughs> 10 feet. At least 15 feet tall. Uh, yeah, we'll loom over him. <laughs> and then we'll get him with a six-foot bag, and yeah. then we'll run we'll in and get the mirror. <laughs> oh, what's your what's about? <laughs> and when his back is turned, one of us will leave the trench coat and go uh-huh. home. Uh-huh. Um, Frame a dog. Oh sure, the dog did it. Yeah, the dog, dog did, did it. it. We'll put in a fake C9 Coke mirror that we'll make that is an exact replica. Money mm-hmm. mirrors. We'll grab one of your mirrors, Ted. Okay, one of the use panels. That. Yep. Yeah. And then we can we'll... use my Coke mirror. I'm uh... <laughs> <laughs> and swap it out. I'll sneak back into the trench coat. Uh huh. And then we'll go. Oot, I've, oot, my stomach hurts. <laughs> we'll have to go to some bathroom. Bleach, Mister Leffian. Wait, I have an important question here. Yeah. So you're you're saying this? Yes. So you're the head? Yes. So what are we what are we doing here? Uh, you're the core. I'm core. And he's the legs. Yeah, I'm definitely the legs. Yeah. You're definitely the legs. Yeah. Why are you definitely the legs? Well, because I'm the tallest. We need to get and oh, okay. since you guys are on my shoulders, yeah. mm-hmm. you you know, the height. my height is the most important. Correct. And I'm and the strongest. You're a strong so core. My arms will be. Yeah. Yeah, so you're gonna be the arms of the situation. Yes. I see. So and I'm, I'm, which, like, and talking, I'm the smartest. I'll, I'll go talk. I'm like the smartest. <laughs> so I can do all the talking. <laughs> you're the Brain. brains of the operation. In this, in this Voltron or whatever we got, I'm the head. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, that's the plan, and then we'll leave. Okay. No one dark. That's Ocean's <laughs> three. That's our. That's our shit. <laughs> in and out. And then I'll, somebody's gonna have to do. We'll also get a small Chinese man to do a back for no reason. <laughs> and then we'll book it out. Right, you're in charge of that one, Mike. I, I got you. I know a guy. Uh, his last name is Ming. Um, <laughs> we're familiar. Uh, our good friend. What was what were you talking about? Oh yeah, the point five. The the fucking Summit. yeah. He won that. I didn't watch that. Who would he beat? Uh he beat. He beat Zane. He said he beat Zane, but then the tweet he's like, "Fuck Zane's like puff or something like that." He beat H box. Zane went puff, oh. and then he tried to go Marth, and then he think he beat. It him. was too late. Yeah, okay. Yeah, which is fair. Get fucked. Um, Why do you try and go puff? I think it's, it's, it's a, point five. So it's like it was no one cares. Oh, it's point five. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. okay. Not the actual no. Gym. In the actual bracket, uh, IBW got the two Pete. Yep. Mm, he won some at 13, won some at 12 last, Over Plup. Year, last year. Yep. He went Plup. off. Plup was playing nuts. Yeah. For the it was uh, IBW, Plup, uh, Hbox, and then J Mook. J Mook, yeah. Because uh, J Mook fucking beat like, fucking everybody. He didn't beat Hbox, he didn't beat Mango. 
I don't think he played Hbox, but he did play Mango, and Mango got him. And I won money. Get fucked, he tossed. Nice. He tossed playing poker on the poker nights, which we can get into later. Yeah. Hey, no, I don't. He's making, last night, we, we did a, a so, cash. What is this? What, what so is there's this? A, a Melee Poker Tournament, global. Tournament? Or, sorry, Discord. Yeah. Um, that is set up because there's going to be a tournament on the 27th. Um, and uh, there's also rooms for cash games. So if anyone like, wants to pin cash games and be like, hey, anyone want to play a table? We'll get five people. They'll, they'll, we'll play some cash games. $25 buy-in minimum. It's fun. Um, these guys are sweaty, but it's fun. Um, They're trying to win money. Yeah, and some of them are pretty good at poker. Uh, and Etos is pretty good. And last night he was feeding so hard that he was on a plane to Europe. He bought Wi-Fi on the plane, uh, did the $25 buy-in, and on the first hand doubled his money. <laughs> and he's like, yeah. Mm-hmm. It was tight. He's also like, he's, he's a dork when it comes to, to poker too. Like uh-huh. The other night he came in, played the first hand, went all in, lost all of his money. And like for five minutes, he's like, what, what would I have done there? <laughs> Something like that. He was like one of those guys. He seems like a nice guy, but he's, he's, a, he's a dork. Uh, he was crying. There's a little crying, but it's okay because yeah. he's still went up for the night. He needed his mama. Uh, I think I'm lifetime like 20 up, which is good. In, in this Discord or? In this Discord. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. They got to make a plug in where they can show how up and down everybody is. We so can see it. Uh, one of the guys, forgot his name, but he's, um, we, every night after the games are done, we get the log from the game. It shows everyone's like, oh, what they bought in for. And then, um, they're final. And then it takes mm-hmm. the, the fucking average the, or not average. The whatever. difference. Difference. Thank you. Jesus. Uh, and so somebody's compiling it into a spreadsheet to make a, uh, a I'm lifetime gonna be, thing. I'm going to be low on that bad Yeah. Boy. You played once and then you, you, I played, you did, you did the Ryan thing where you're just like, I'll shoved. just play a bunch. Yeah. I was, I was in, uh, I was in my hotel room. It uh-huh. was the Thursday night before I had to go. Uh-huh. So I was just killing all the beers in my oh, fridge. Oh, classic, yep. And just like hanging out. And Patty's like, hey, what are you doing? And I'm like, oh, what? Well, I don't know. What's up, man? <laughs> He's like, oh, I'm playing poker. I'm like, oh, poker's fun. Uh-huh. And get in on these fucking nerds are folding and, and only playing good hands. You, uh, and, oh, my you God. You might be up on Patty because Patty, well, maybe. Patty, Patty is. Patty's probably one more than he, I have, though. I've only won, I've only won like a couple hands. I was, I always have a face card and something. I'd be like, yep. Let's go. Let's go. My, my, my thing, Ted, you're going to love mm-hmm. this. So mm-hmm. funny. Mm-hmm. Whenever I wanted to make any size bet, uh-huh. I'd only bet $4.20. <laughs> and nice. You, and then we had like 25 bucks. Okay. So like there was no people that we normally raise like, you know, like 50 cents, 30 cents. Uh-huh. I'm like, it's first 420, bet, 420. baby. It goes nice. back around to me, 420. <laughs> <laughs> and then someone makes like 25 bucks off me. And then I go. One more, Patty. Give me, <laughs> buy me in again, and do it all over again. Hell yeah! But it's a good time. I like it. It's fine. That was Joshuashu, uh, Joshuasha. Can't remember. Uh, guy's tight. He made the Discord. He's throwing the tournament. A lot of people are entering. It's cool. Is it an yeah. online tournament? Yeah. Yeah, and it's separated by region. Huh. Uh, so there's an East Coast one. There's a fucking West Coast one. Whatever, whatever. Um, I'm pumped. I love poker. It's a fun game. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, I, don't, I don't really like it that much. Do you know how to play it? It's kind of just boring. Do you know how to play it? No, I'm, I don't know how to play it. I don't think you do. Not like super well, but like I, know, I mean, not saying no. Saying I don't know how to play poker is ridiculous. Like I know how to. But play the way you poker. play it isn't the way you're supposed to play poker. Yeah, I play for fun. Sure. It was the point of the games? It's fun. Sure. But you're not wave dashing or l canceling and saying this game's boring. I'm done with it. No. And Mike's saying this game's exciting. There's more to play here. I, I am trying to wave dash and wave dash and L cancel and perfect pivot like fucking mm. whatever. Yeah. The I'm shit. never going for suicide dare. You are know? going for suicide dare. Yeah. yeah. And I'm dying. I'm not, I'm not going to recover after. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. Yeah. I'm, like, I'm like, I got you. I got a stock. I got the <laughs> one time bomb. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. That's funny. But it's okay. Whatever. I know. No. Different strokes. I was saying that I probably would have as much fun uh, betting on like whether a card is a red or black mm. is playing poker. Like, roulette. Roulette. Yeah. Yeah. But like, yeah, we used to, we still drinking him all the time when we were incredibly bored, which was pick, just picking a deck of cards red and, black. and saying red or black when we were in the room, and that, that's the whole game. When you get it right, you don't drink because that's a punishment. <laughs> and, if you, and if you get it if you get it wrong, you drink. Ah, oh, <laughs> dang. No, it's cool. Yeah, join the Discord. It's fun. Uh, twenty seventh tournament. Pumped on. Where it. can they join that Discord? Uh. Someone's Twitter has it. I, I retweeted it like a few days ago or a week ago. You'll find it. So go to michaelallen.com. Go to michael.com. <laughs> michael.com. Uh, like and subscribe. <laughs> um, What else? What, oh, yeah. So sorry. Back to Summit. That was a fun little poker nope. side. But, uh, no? No. 
No, nah. that's fine. Summit was okay. Nothing else to talk about, actually. Salt went. Salt was fun to watch. I liked uh, J Mook. Nobody else. I can't really think of anything else that happened. Nope. Uh, it is wild how many good people got out early. Yeah. Nothing I was about to ask. Not to name any names. Seems, do, do not know. <laughs> uh, how did uh uh ninth? Oh, yeah. tied of Leffen. Oh, Leffen the mango. That guy lost a lot. Yeah, yeah. And then Zane fifth, right? Zane fifth. Yeah. Zane lost to J Mook. J Mook got him. I forgot. Yeah. Mm -hmm. J Mook's tight, dude. It was a J Zane was not playing well. No, but I wouldn't say so. But J Mook. Fucking did did fucking get the W. Ooh, yeah, it was tight. Jamie Cones. Jamie does own new new fave, new one of them. What are you guys thinking? Like top five looks like right now. That's a good question. Yeah, I mean, Dane. Result wise, IBDW strictly right now for the first like month of this game because it just it, it just kind of came for, back. For IRL, yeah. As yeah, yeah. far as like Genesis right now, after yeah, you gotta say. I mean, it's some combination of Zane. Uh, Plup, Hbox, J Mook, and then probably Amsa. Amsa's in there too. Not IBDW. You said you oh, I, I'm IBDW. IBDW then over Amsa. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Is Hbox up that high? Yeah, I, I think Hbox did. I'd say so. Yeah, he did. He did well enough in because I'm like three tournaments to go off. Go off of right now, really. Mm -hmm. There's Genesis, Pound, and Summit. Yep. I forgot about Pound. Are the three like really big ones? Mm -hmm. Um, and. Hbox got top eight in all of them, yeah. and got at least top. I think top th three or four in all of them. Or no, he got fifth at Genesis. Question mark. I don't know. IBDW did tweet today, and I forgot that the perspective is this: that it's it's like that's like a month of tournaments. Yeah, yeah. It's just Mango doing awful yeah. in like this one month of tournaments, which kind of yeah. sucks. But that's a lot of like big tournaments to happen in like a yeah. month, and just it being the the a uh, time where he's just perform underperforming is just kind of. Kind of sucks. No, well, I, I um, uh, what did it's funny because that it used to just be like one tournament all year, you know, right? Like I mean? it would be like one at the beginning, yeah, of the year, so and it's maybe like, one. Like, we're like, this is just fall. three tournaments in a month, you can't judge them off that. And yeah, it's yeah, like, yeah, yeah. it should just be one, and that was <laughs> it. Yeah. If you fucked up, you were a poser, <laughs> <laughs> you suck ass, you loser. That's that reminds yeah. me, I think they were talking about this on Summit Commentary, uh, about uh. I think it was Phil calling Armada being top whatever when he was first coming over for Genesis. Mm -hmm. um, and it would have, it is just it, them putting in perspective how Armada coming over and I'm talking this good shit about Armada from Europe, Armada from Europe, uh -huh. uh, from all the European people, and him coming over. And if he just fucking ate shit, uh -huh. endless ridicule. <laughs> Europe, <laughs> Europe would have won one tournament. It. Yeah, that's, that would have been fucking Oh, funny. that would have been really good, yeah, actually. Good. I wish that happened. Yeah. Europe uh, would have smelled it forever. <laughs> they would have smelt it <laughs> because they dealt it. Yeah. <laughs> and they already still suck. So they do. It, exactly. So imagine if they never even had that. But that they just have like a couple Swedish lads who carry them through. Yep. And uh That's true. The height of the rain for the height of the European rain was like four guys. Yeah. Yeah. Well, Swedes Arguably. are just like unhealthy at video games. It's crazy. Yeah. I don't know why. Because it's cold, they have nothing to worry about. They, they don't have anything to do. They're, yeah, there's, there's, <laughs> they're done. It's literally nothing. <laughs> they can walk outside to the they gray, battle. or they can go play the colorful Minecraft inside. Mm. Sure. Uh, but I watched a manga stream today, and or the other day rather, and he was talking about. It, and he's like, you know what, guys, it's okay. You know, I wasn't feeling it. I'm feeling it now. I definitely, lo I definitely lost some it. Was like, I'm mad. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still good at this game. I'm, I'm gonna fucking. I got this. That mm -hmm. Kodoran set was poopy. It was. Did he lose to Kodoran? Yeah. He did lose That's to Kodoran. Game nice. five last hit, right? Yeah. yeah. Well, get fucked. It's like getting beat up by your little brother. It, it is. is. Nobody likes that. Nobody likes that. Nobody likes that. Mm. That man like, fought like fucking 10 people at the after party after. I keep seeing photos on Twitter of him <laughs> fighting people. <laughs> yeah. yeah. He's like drunk fighting people. Tell me more. Uh... He got Yingling. He got Kadoran. He got what is that? What is, what is attacking them? Like no, 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 wrestling? No, 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 not attacking. Like, like squaring up. Okay, trying to square up with them. Not trying, succeeding. They squaring they up. squared back. Yeah, yeah. Okay, let's, let's fight. Active, active tussle. Yeah. Okay, so they were. It was consensual. Yeah. Okay. Oh yeah. No, okay. no it's always like a it's, a it's a duel. Okay. Mango, Mango, Mango says let's let's go, and you put them up, and you and you, and you fight. Okay. That's how it goes. And J Mook uh, spin kicked him in the dick. <laughs> <laughs> I 
I can see him doing that. Yeah, that's tight. <laughs> Those glasses Jay Mook wear, he looks like he knows karate. <laughs> it's crazy. <laughs> Sleeper agent. The video of it, you can hear in the background someone going, Is that allowed? <laughs> <laughs> that's so funny. Do you see the clip of uh, Hungry Box? Because Hungry Box was doing, he was streaming on his phone the side streams. It clip. wasn't his phone. Was it, was it not? It was a camera? No, no. They, they Their sponsor had a little tiny computer. That's cute. Oh, yeah. that's cool. So there's the HBox side stream and then Mango. Oh, yeah, uh... Mango walking up to the, the stream and going up and being like, I, I, <laughs> I fucking hate Hungerbox. If he ever beats me like that again, I swear we're, we're throwing hands. Or <laughs> and he said that. And then uh, he's like, I swear on my mother. And then Hungerbox comes up from behind him. He's like, you swear what on your mother? And he's like, nothing. Let's go, Juan. <laughs> <laughs> and then later on, HBox made this big fucking YouTube content creator uh moment where he was like guys i challenge mango to boxing to a fight because right now this whole like content creator boxing thing is like a big thing yeah, 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 yeah um yeah. jesus christ michael <laughs> mike doing the loudest activity he could <laughs> go say hi to the rat for us sidebar before we start this podcast we were filming from a live studio audience mm -hmm. um uh, a rat is in our house. Yep. It's fucking, it's awesome. We just figured it out right now. Yeah. It's awesome. We get to hang out with him forever now. So. And probably all his family. Yeah. He's soon, he's soon to be family. Yeah. We're already a live family. Okay. And all their children, too. Yeah. That'd be great. Could be oodles of them in these Could walls. Could be oodles and caboodles. Um, I can hear them scratching. <laughs> no. All around me. <laughs> don't, don't, don't do that. Uh, but uh, what am I saying about Mango and the other thing? I was talking about something. He's got right. his mojo back. His baby. mojo. <laughs> He's in his bag. Oh no, no, no. the con, the fight, the content fight. Oh stuff. yeah, yeah. So Hbox is like, yo, I'm gonna fucking, I'm gonna fucking fight the the world. Is he gone? I think he's using the bathroom or something. Oh okay. Um. He's like, he's like, I challenge Mango to a fucking, to a fight. We're going to fucking, mm -hmm. let's do this. And, uh, and Mango's like, I'm not doing that. I will fight him to a death in a locker room. <laughs> no cameras, no, 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 no content, nothing. Uh -huh. Two of us walk in, one of us leave. <laughs> I'm okay with one of us leaving this world. <laughs> uh -huh. so, we'll, we'll see. I think it will be cool, but. I think the whole, I mean, I've seen, I don't watch the content creator, like, boxing thing, mm -hmm. but I mean, you've heard of it, right? You've... Yeah, Sam Hyde keeps trying to box people. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I keep seeing. And when I've, I've seen uh, uh, one of the girls who fought, uh, Justin Minx, um, she, like, worked out, like, did a whole routine to, like, learn how to fight and stuff, too. I don't know if that's what everyone did, but, like, that's super sick. Is she in a fight? Yeah, yeah, she's in a fight. Oh. But she like did like a regimen and like woke okay. up and dieted and like actually damn she got ready. Yeah. Like I'm gonna fucking Did she win? Yeah, she did win. Nice. Did the other girl train? I don't know. I bet she didn't. You gotta train for that a little bit. Yeah, but not you know, like I waking like, up early. And... No, no, no. Imagine like, putting that off like the last minute. Like I have a fight. It's like, yeah, I'm just gonna go wing it. Like I don't They're content creators. Yeah. I'm sure a bunch of them must have done that. Yeah. Do you won the fights? What did you hear? It was a uh, it was Game Grumps versus Epic Meal Time. No, dude, not, I didn't know that people were actually doing this. Dude. I thought it was just a joke. Epic Meal Time guy versus Aaron, uh, Aaron, whatever his name is, Hanson, is it, or is that the guy who does pet up the? Okay, okay, okay. Eagle Raptor, yeah, that's his name. Uh, yeah, they fought. I don't know who won that. I imagine uh, Epic Meal Time guy must have watched him. Yeah, I mean, there's got a, some big weight differential there. So he had the cornrows. That was funny. Yeah, he did. That's yeah. a good look. <laughs> Love when people do that. Everyone was dicking on him on Twitter. Mm -hmm. But it was clear for the bit, right? Yeah, I'm assuming so. Yeah. yeah. He wasn't like this is like he's self aware. He was like, this is a good look to do. Okay. He's like, yeah, fucking put up my hair and up like that. Sure. <laughs> why not? Uh what's the bit? Uh that's like the MMA look, I think, isn't it? That people fucking run with? Like they have long hairs. They do the cornrows. Yeah, I think I, think, I have I think, seen that. I think that's mm. the, maybe the joke. If that is the joke. In know. high school, my my friend, my whole class wanted me to get cornrows, and I said no. 
That's whack. That does sound swell. I can't imagine you. Actually, why, I can. Why funny. would I do that? No. <laughs> I'm, I'm having a little game. Come on, Ryan. Make us laugh. 10, no. 10 uh, 20 sub goal, 20 subs. Nope. No. Ryan does porn <laughs> No, no. They'd be so long, I think, at this point. That'd be tight. No. But anyway. But anywho. But anywho, uh, I think we, you know, it's it's too bad you walked away then, Mike. Could, we want to do a break now? We can do a break. You want to do a break? We have a, we have a, we have a little break segment we can do. Sure. Let's do that. Let's run the clip. We have Patty's Patty segment. Patty's uh, halftime show. That's what we call it. Yeah. Patty's halftime show. Coming to you now. Hello, boys. A uh, little fun update. Look it. Um, can you see? Oh, not really. But that's a, that's a beach. I'm, at, I'm on vacation. Vacation all I ever want. Okay, um... Patty here to, to give you a quick wrap up of the stuff that's been going on with Smash GG to start GG as well as the sumo.gg thing. Okay, here, Tech Green and anyone in chat, here's what's happening. So, uh, Smash GG was like, hey, we're changing our name to start GG because like we don't want to just be smashed. Fine, whatever, cool, all good. Um, they announced their date. They, they go through this whole name change. Um, it's pretty, they, so they, they switched to start GG. It's pretty, you know, uneventful. Their logo kind of looks like Split Gates logo, so there's a little bit of controversy there. Um, but overall, like, probably wouldn't have been really anything you guys would have talked about on this podcast. But then uh, what happened was uh, our friends at Metify launched a thing on the same date as Smash G's rebrand called uh, Sumo.gg. Uh, sumo uh, by the way, the, the rebrand stuff, all on my birthday. So I had a fun little time on Twitter with everybody freaking out on my birthday. Um, and especially about bracket stuff. Perfect. Hell yeah. Uh, match made in heaven. Anyway. Um, so sumo.gg, uh, made by Metify, comes out and they're like, hey, fuck Smash GG. Okay, they're not like that. But they're like, uh, literally on their main website, it's like, uh, it's like making a bracket platform that doesn't suck. Um, they have a bunch of a bunch of things that's like listed as like good things like no ads yada yada one of those things is not Microsoft um, also that they're developing a mobile app um, so so the reaction when when sumo.gg initially launches is is pretty positive I must say like uh, Hungrybox puts out a tweet kind of goes a little bit viral um, and people in the replies like fuck smash gg vibes you know because it's been that for instance when 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 smash gg announced that they were rebranding to star gg the quote retweets were just filled with make a fucking app fuck you F i hate you i hate everything you've done to me and all the personal problems you've caused me make a fucking app fuck you so it's not like you know the, the people's reaction to them branding to star gg was necessarily positive um but just seeing Sumo, this other, this new brand, obviously like Metify has been a part, they've been hosting uh, lessons, come out and, and, and just to like attack Smash GG. Um, again, at first the reaction was positive, uh, but then, you know, the OGs, the OGs started speaking up. And it, the, the way I would relate this is, is uh, it's, it's like Smash GG is our, our shitty drunk uncle who just like, he comes to the parties, uh, but he shows up wasted. He's late. He might be with a new, a new chick. Her name's Rocket League. And we're just supposed to like accept her. Like she's normal. Like he just, he, he doesn't really come through on his promises like ever. And, uh, in our overall, like just, just vibe towards him has been pretty low. Just not, not great. Uh, but then this like, stepdad this dude who just married into the family just came to the family dinner and like spat in his face like went on a rant talked about how shitty that drunk uncle is and all of us as a family in melee we all stood up for our shitty drunk uncle it was a massive fucking horde of people on twitter defending smash gg or should i say start gg now in ways that i've i've never seen before it was everyone was just like bro 
yeah, okay, they don't make a mobile app, you know, some of their platform is straight up broken, but you know fucking what, they've been here for five years, they came to our little league games, they have been supporting us for a hot minute, and yeah, there are parts that of, of our shitty drunk uncle that we would like to change, but he's our shitty drunk uncle, you can't just come in here and act like we're just gonna totally ditch this dude who's just been with us for a hot minute, um, so yeah, so uh, like, you know, at the end of the day, I think if sumo.gg comes in and they, they make a bracket platform, um, I think it'll be very interesting to see what changes on start.gg's side, right? Like, like, are there things that they provide that actually creates change? Uh, or, and, and also like part of it is uh, that sumo.gg really hasn't talked about, and uh, maybe Ryan can do a, a little bit of due diligence of, of explaining what uh what their ceo on twitter was doing basically just clowning around just making an ass of himself um but uh so so like what's sumo.gg in for right are they here to try and take over the major events are they here to try and take over the locals like there's there's the the way that they present their bracket platform completely changes depending on which of those is the goal of course the answer is probably both of them at the end of the day but like what is your immediate events that you're targeting um and i think that will, will give us a really clear idea as to what the fuck this is going to be uh because is it going to have progressions is it going to just going to be challenge uh, a lot of people don't know that challenge made a like fake smash gg but it just it just did not go well it was a pretty bad platform um so i think my biggest questions to y'all are just what are your vibes coming off of like what's your vibe towards sumo.gg and what's your vibe towards start.gg uh and like what do you think about the rebrand and um and and what do you guys think is is like best case for sumo right so so we can we can rag on them all they want they had a weird introduction where they decided to shit on a different a different company that's been a part of us um but like what do you guys want out of sumo.gg do you want them to try and tackle like you know the mamoms the, the the functions of the world those big regionals uh or do you think it's a better idea for them to go after the majors or maybe even the stupid small uh weeklies that are on challenge um so what do you think is the best case for sumo.gg hope you've been well y'all uh have fun in chat peace out y'all all right wow wow patty thank you so much miss you let me see all your petty insights in the chat yeah damn dude what was he saying about me checking out the coe you, yeah you right that was <laughs> where's our uh briefing on the ceo <laughs> of this of, new company sumo.gg or whatever it is yeah, oh. where's where where his <laughs> nba from huh or the metify guy yeah, so I was, I was looking into it, guys, in, in the one minute pet he gave me <laughs> after watching his video. Uh, I think I know he's, what he's talking about, but uh, I think a part, a part of it was the fact that um, uh, they're like, hey, this is like a sumo.gg is like a, a, a crowd source, like a community funded like thing. We, we're doing this together. We're a community. Yeah, fuck Microsoft. Yeah, and then, uh, and then Jack Zilla, friend of the pod, been on the show. A couple times, uh, search the CEO's Twitter for uh, mango. How many times his Twitter has tweeted the word mango? <laughs> zero tweets. Part of the community, zero tweets about mango. Did he? Did he try it with the zero? In the he did. Okay, he okay. did. He did. That's <laughs> funny. He did. You gotta try. You gotta try it both. Yeah. Okay. I, I would also. Uh, I, I tried doing it on my Twitter. I have a lot of tweets about mango. Sure. <laughs> a lot of them are just mango, mango, mango. <laughs> <laughs> You're getting three pings on that. That's, That's <laughs> funny. But um, uh, yeah, it's a fun thing to do. Tight. Um, but yeah, uh, Simo.gg and what do they do? I hate it. Uh, the them. I'm team. I'm team OG. I'm team. Start.gg. Yeah. No, no, no. Oh. I'm Team Shalonge. Yeah, 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 yeah. You, you guys have strayed from the path of Shalonge. No, no, no. You got, everybody got oodled by the sirens at no, Smash no, no, GG. No, 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 no. It's at, at, drifted over the pond and said, Ooh, I got, no, no, oh, my no. Twitch stream is automatically winked in here. Ooh, I can see what characters they played. Oh, wow, this is so amazing. Shalonge right. fucking works every time. It's so easy. For locals. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. You're right, and 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 you we would never use at our tournaments uh, for our locals and stuff. We always use Chalon. We did always use Chalon. Mm -hmm. it's, it's, it's just quick and easy. Yeah, it's college ship. Yeah. But if you, if you do anything that has any kind of like scope to it, you Smash G works perfect for it. 
Like if you're doing pools that fail during an actual tournament, way easier on challenge. And I mean, way easier on Smash G than it is challenge. But for for fucking weeklies for easy shit, yeah, challenge is snappy. It's quick. It's awesome. So I don't know where fucking this sumo thing fits into that. Because if I want to do an event page, I'll make a Smash G page, and it'll be a whole thing. And if I want to do a quick dirty bracket right now, I'll do challenge. Yeah. It's because they're time tested. This new guy is talking all that good, good when mm-hmm. they haven't even proven themselves yet. Especially with Met- Metify being a relatively new company, isn't it? Doctor? Yeah. Yeah. Oh my God, it's all. Oh, dude. Oh, I got you, didn't <laughs> oh I? God. Oh, you got him. Maybe blue you got him. Out. Oh, let's get some like talkies. <laughs> yeah. Um. Fucking. Fuck Wait, that. So what is? What else does Metify do? I feel like that name's like familiar. Yeah, they do the coaching stuff. They host a service so, where people can. Uh, where, where, where you can pay PPMD to watch anime with them. That's the uh, that's the main service. Okay. Yeah. So it's like escort kind of, you sure. know, it's lessons seeking arrangements kind of. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. You you ask Mutu King and he goes, you need to you need to practice more. <laughs> <laughs> like thanks, man. That'll be two hundred. Oh, awesome. Well, what's the rest of the hour gonna be? Oh, I'm gonna leave. <laughs> Sweet dude. That's it. I'm gonna play Kingdom Hearts. <laughs> Goodbye. Uh Mewtwo King. Yeah, but I don't know. I don't know who's gonna like they're gonna have to offer some TO some serious fucking uh dosh, I believe the phrase is. That's you go. Can I, can I go off on a quick tan? Oh, go on. Tang. King? Yeah. Mewtwo King's Facebook? Just a gem. Oh yeah. The Jason Zimmerman Facebook. Is it active? Oh yeah. He's po he posts. Damn. Anybody He's still there. Who- Anyone who's not friends or following Jason Zimmerman on Facebook, uh huh, gotta get on that. Shoot him a, shoot him a, uh, yeah, shoot him a friend request. He's not. Bu- I imagine he'd be he'd be capped at this point. Is there a cap? Yeah, he might be. Yeah, I don't know, but you could like follow him. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, not like it's any remarkable kind. It's just funny to see what Beauty King's posting. Uh-huh. He's just an interesting poster, in my opinion. Is he sharing any like cool links? Yeah, he'll like post a video and be like, ha. <laughs> <laughs> It'll be like cool. <laughs> Mewtwo King thinks it's you ever even watch it? Oh yeah, I, I watch the stuff. <laughs> <laughs> well, if he's laughing, I gotta see what's up. <laughs> well, I watch most things on the feed. I'm always like, hmm, what's this now? Mm-hmm. You, you need need to consume. Yeah, I'm a consumer. But yeah, so that's the end of the tangent. We can go back, but oh okay. <laughs> <laughs> Mewtwo King's Facebook, a pleasure. Check it out. Um, notice the um uh I don't know like, assume I I don't know who's the gonna- gall. They're gonna have to like offer people a bunch of money to actually use their their platform because we're we're so in with I don't know I think the whole idea of like attacking Smash EG in Microsoft and stuff is so like I so didn't was perfect it's so weak I, like, I don't think it's perfect I think it's perfect I think it's, it's if anything it's a little derogatory towards Smash EG Ohana means family it's a it's a little like re- reaching you know what yeah. I mean How do you get the Michael Allen seal of approval Yeah I. I I agree with Patty. I hate to admit it, but uh, yeah, I do. I think Bust One was one of the first tournaments run on Smash EG. Yeah, and I was there for it, and I like Smash EG. Nice. <laughs> Let's go Bust One. Let's go Bust One. I was at Bust Two. Remember three. when they did that like ranking system where you'd have like a little free for all and get like an Elo and like play people in your Elo? I don't yeah. Like out of yeah. What was that shit called? Wasn't the ladders? Yeah, Anthos the ladder. Ladder. It wasn't an- they, uh, they still have the ladders, I believe. Oh yeah. At certain events. It's not Anthos ladder. No, no, no. That that that's the old net play. Yes, we're talking about the ladder system in at the weeklies. I don't remember that. That's we cool. we did that for a little bit here. Is yeah, I think it's still the team and what team and T does. Do they? Yeah, they cool. do it online. Gotcha. Okay, that's cool. Huh? So you play that a was bunch. a Smash GG thing though. Yeah, no. I mean, it, it's really cool. It's a cool system. Yeah. Except for then you have like the the best players when we when they play like four sets and then they just like don't play until. Like yeah, hours they, later, they get way more bracket matches. That shit isn't for them. No, they don't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But they don't. They don't play as much uh, tournament games because people don't go get to the level high enough. Oh, that's yeah. what I remember. I remember it being like they would complain because they'd play for a little bit and then they'd be put in this tier where no one could reach them. Yeah, everyone else is like two twoing them yeah, like yeah, yeah. each other and not ever that's getting funny. up to like the. Yeah. That's what I'm saying though. Not getting high enough. The ladder is for the people who go to two at bracket. Yeah, and yeah want yeah. more matches. Yeah, and so the people who are making the deep bracket ones are the ones who get up into that top tier rank yeah. and only get yeah. to play four matches. Yeah, and it's like okay, this isn't for you anyway. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's not good for everyone at the event is a thing. No, no. Yeah. But it's not like for them as much. Sure, it's sure, more sure. For someone but they're there. Going, oh, two or one, two. Yeah. The problem is that a, uh, uh, a section of people who are there to play the game are, are, aren't playing the aren't game. Playing the game which, is, yeah. which is bad for them, but good for all the people who are there to learn and to, to get better. And exactly. Stuff like that, which yeah. sucks because it's a, it's a thing and whatever. But You get no. more people net playing the game. Yeah, we we had a, we had a one team. I figured, figured out who was doing it at that point, but it was we did that all the time. Yeah, that was that was like a whole like season of uh the weekly was doing NGP? that. Yeah, yeah, we was, was doing. That. Well, speaking of New England melee, we had an Arcadian this last weekend. Sure, I'm um, just cool. We'll just close out on uh, what's it called on on oh, the, yeah, you... on the bracket stuff. Just just a uh, Patty. Good good talk. Thanks, good Patty. Good points. Mm-hmm. Um, Simo sucks. Um, they have no place here. Shout out Start GG rebrand. Yeah, Start GG rebrand's cool. Looks all right. I'm into it. You're doing the the stuff for that. I don't know if that's a little. Uh, I think Simo's a that. bad name too. Sumo. Yeah. What is that? Dot GG. Also sucks. Don't pick an S name. We already <laughs> have that. You're being an yeah, asshole. Yeah, two of those. It's Magic G and Start GG. Well, now we have Start GG. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's their thing. They were S dot GG forever. Yeah. And they were trying to encroach on the on the fucking our side of the alphabet. Pussy. Fuck you. Um no. Whatever. I'm sure they're nice people, but fuck you. Are they like Eat shit. are they even really melee players though? Uh they aren't Met- I don't know if Metify is a is a smash centric thing. I I, okay, so. if they can't beat me in a best of five. <laughs> they, they shouldn't be allowed to run a practice. Get Ted. Ted they gotta be... have someone on their executive staff who can beat me in a best of five. Yep. You that, that's go. when you find out like M2K like owns part of the company. Say. Yeah, it's like okay, cool. Like, <laughs> that's good. I remember, when, I remember when Mewtwo King had that long ass line of sponsors in front of his name. Oh, yeah. MVG, MVG, Echo, Echo, Fox. MVG uh, got him with some sort of crazy contract. That holy shit, they got him by the balls. They're they're on his ass. Yeah. Yeah. That's crazy. Back in the day. And still now, probably, right? Is it still on VG Mewtwo King? Shit, I don't know. Might what? be. Yeah. He also has his own company, I'm pretty sure, too, that he adds to that. Or maybe he has and MGK. MGK. <laughs> com. And MGK.com. Make sure you go there. Wrote a book. A lot of MGK talk. No book yet. We love MGK. He's in the classic no, guy. You're, the book's out. <laughs> you can go the, get book's the book's not out. Okay, you skipped the book's out. Of me. I wish the All these people out. saying they'll write a book, don't write this book. Clint. The Clint no. books never happen. Where, when's the Clint book? Clint can't even stream. <laughs> yes, he can't write a book. He's Every time somebody asks, he's like, I'm writing it, guys. It's really hard to write a book. Yeah, I'm it, sure it is. That, that's what I was about to say. Writing a book is hard. It does sound difficult. That's a long thing to do. Yeah. It's a lot yeah, of words. Yeah. Mm. But anyways, Ted, you're talking about the uh the 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 arcade of what? The, the what now? Arcadian. The New England Arcadian. Yeah. Which one is this? This is the latest one. Eighth? I want to say it's up there. Seven, the last eight, one, eight, is, eight. the last one, hysteric one. Yep. Yes. In 2019 or something. And crazy. this one was won by someone who I think a lot of people say, I actually don't know who, and that is Q. Q. Who is someone who, if you ask Stock Buddy, Stock Buddy would say, "Oh, dude, that guy's nasty. Q, so good, dude. That guy's sick." Uh huh. Naturally. But, just has not been to a lot of like New England locals, uh huh. So people aren't super familiar with him. Who w- does Q play? Q plays Fox. Nice. He's a very good Fox player. Okay, uh, cool, um, cool. I was worried for a minute there. I'm thinking like, oh, that's some fucking Martha. I've never heard of this guy. Yukon, I believe. In oh, origin, we love Yukon. Um, and this is actually interesting. Let's go Doom. I did a little digging, and uh, it turns out when I was in Connecticut, I actually got to watch some accuse matches on Halloween Hog. Mm-hmm. And I got oh, to, Hello Hog. I got to watch um Halloween. Q beat Kikaho. Wait, it might have been the week before Halloween, but Q beat Kikaho there. Okay. And Kikaho, New England PR. Yep. Yep. Nasty. Um, Marth, right? Marth. Yep. Marth. Yep. Mark, From CT. Mark player. Uh Q beat him and then lost to Artie twice in this hog, right? Couldn't be me. Early in uh winners he lost to him and then made the long run and losers lost to him in grands. Uh-huh. Yeah. At the Arcadian this weekend, Q beats Artie Ooh, to win the Arcadian. The Michael Allen. He did. The Michael Allen. Did the exactly. 
And so, <laughs> fun little, I don't know what their history is total, but I know that the last time I already took two sets off them and at the Arcadian where it really mattered in Grands, this dude won. So that's pretty Just sick. That. Damn. And uh, he beat a lot of other good people. Good and for him. so, uh, pretty sick run. A lot of like, you know, of the people who you would expect to be there, I feel like we're there. Can you and, shoot some uh, names real quick? Because I, I, I just hit me with some, some I think, shit. I mean, I uh, Hex Joe, Artie, um, Artie not Shmeli. A PR anywhere yet is, is why. Yeah, we were saying the fact that Artie could still enter Arcadia. That's, that's yeah, that's weird. insane. Yeah, it feels way too good. Yeah, right. Just yeah. the history of has you just been that good like forever, but never good enough. Is that what the thing mm -hmm. is? Yeah, that's I think crazy. Awesome video games. <laughs> I love that guy. <laughs> uh, I've never t I've never talked to him before. No, uh, his tag is Ireland so as well. Very oh, good Ireland, from yep. Rhode Island. Zosa's brother. Yep, Zosa's brother. Uh -huh. Actually, that's not his yeah, I know. It's just funny <laughs> to say. Cause it makes me remember Dr. Mario Luther King. Yeah. Which is also when he beats brother. the end of Mario, yeah. uh -huh. it was so tight. <laughs> Number two on Tien's legendary losses. Yeah. <laughs> um, tight. Yeah, man. I, uh, yeah, I didn't go that way. I know Phil was there. Oh, uh, Rye guy. Phil. That's you, dude. Phil, any words about the Arcadian? Yeah, get the mic on. Our producer, Phil. Hey. Woo. Hey. hey. We try on. Buddy. Um, yeah, I mean, I really enjoyed the Arcadian. It was so funny commentating because Q was, we were commentating Q sets mm -hmm. and it was just like, no one knew, it, it, at least the people I talked to, nobody knew. And I was just like, is this the Q that everybody's talking about? Oh, mm -hmm. like the, the pizza? Yeah. The P pizza gate and, and all that. Uh, I thought it was very brave that Q showed up to play Melee. Of course, Q's here. With the Q level conspiracy. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. He's got the clearances. Um, I w watched all of the tournaments stay till the end. Uh, was really just kind of focused on amateur bracket and watching two sharks win that. So nice. I love two sharks. Who two sharks guy? <laughs> He's on the come up. Who two sharks beat in grands of amateurs? Uh, the guy with the hat with his name. Dude, on it. <laughs> that's crazy. Donald get, Trump. Get Wait, voodoo? No, no. Uh, um, the chic player. It's numbers. Yeah, Alter with the numbers. Fourteen K um, or something yeah, like that. Twenty two K. Twenty two K. Twenty two. Oh wow! Yeah, yeah. I was really happy because he uh, he's the guy that I lost to in regular bracket, and uh -huh. he was like swagging on me, and so he was, was down cool. airing and shit. He he switched. He did that thing where you play three different characters in a best of five. Oh, and I was like, guy. I was like, wow, that sucks. An Arcadian. Yeah. Damn. Speaking of which, I think <laughs> Got Worcester, Phil. <laughs> Repping Worcester? Uh, That's pretty he's from Worcester. Waz. He is Waz. Yeah, he's a Waz. 22K is Waz. 22K is Waz. You got Waz. That's true. Mm -hmm. That's funny. Yeah. Crazy. Yeah. Shout out to Two Sharks. Welcome to the city, kid. <laughs> Shout out to Two Sharks. The city. <laughs> two Sharks is tight. The city. It's like a barren land. Like, can't wait, you'd expect can't a wait for shine. Two Sharks is tight. He be, I don't know if I said this on the podcast, but... Two Sharks beat me in a set harder than I've ever beaten by anybody in my entire life before at an NGP. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's crazy good. Um, and I like him. And, and, you're, you're, and you think you were at your worst at that moment as well. To be Just fair. In, in me, me being you, a competitor. Your gameplay, like, yeah. Yeah, probably. Yeah. Oh, God, it was bad. <laughs> but but like, it's not like... He was, he was also just... It wasn't me being bad. It was him being fucking good. And sure. he was capitalizing. His, his punish was nuts. That guy's crazy. Falco player? Yeah. It's probably, wow, I'm playing a really good uh, IC's computer right now. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you. <yeah. laughs> um, Another fun little Arcadian fact for everybody. Oh, fun, oh. Uh, a fun fact? I'm, Wait, like, a faff. This is a, a, a Ted Green, I think I remember this is what's going on fact. Love but, these ones. Um, these are so good. So already second at this Arcadian, right? Uh-huh. I'm pretty sure he also got second at like the first or second tri-state arcadian oh i love someone to fact check me on that my but favorite I, thing about a ted faff mm -hmm. is that you oh you kind of only like a little bit know yeah about the thing. I, I, I know there's an english it's there's like something an, going on. A, a sense there <laughs> <laughs> it sounds correct exactly <laughs> like i know there's some hype around Artie and arcadian when he would go to new york mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. am i ringing bells phil somewhat there's a whole period of my life where I was in Vermont that I just don't know anything about New England Melee, so. True. It's Despite still being a part of New England Melee, because uh, Vermont is just a adjacent. different world. No. I, I remember being at no. a, a, the Nebs where Tori and oh, 
Artie, classic team, Bonfire 10 and Artie, mm-hmm. uh, beat um, IBDW and who's the Icy's player? Um, oh, um, is it New York guy? or Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, you know who I'm talking about. Icy's? Yeah, yeah, the classic Icy's guy. In New York? He played the music, uh, like orchestra player. Um, oh, oh Diz Kid. Kid. Diz Kid. Yeah, 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 thank you. I, mean, yeah. I don't know why that was so hard. That was hard. Diz Kid. I don't know why that was so hard. Yeah, yeah I forgot. So, so the orchestra's a gr- great hint. What? Yeah. Music, yeah, yeah, musically yeah. inclined Ice yeah. Climbers player. Yeah. That was yeah. awesome. It's got Diz Kid written all over it. Yeah. Unless your name is uh, Army. The one that track. Crush just absolutely ooped on his chest. That was very funny. <laughs> one, that- of, one of the most BM sets of oh, like all time. Yeah. We watched that live. And the disc kid. This kid's a nice guy. <laughs> like, Such a nice guy to be him. Yeah, it very makes rude. It so much sweeter. <laughs> but he would, yeah. But when there's absolutely no reason to just poop on this person's chest. Yeah, this is this is uh, Crush versus this kid Boogie at Royal Flush. Yeah. Um, and best tournament of all time. And, and and yeah, this kid is like smiling, like nodding the whole time. He's like, yeah, yeah, you can do that to me. I'm I'm squalling. Yeah. You can taunt. This yeah, kid's like I'm... seven years older than him or yeah. something. Like... A full full adult man. <laughs> yeah, he's just like, I don't know what to yeah. do about this. <laughs> I love I love when the opposite with with uh I just remember remember made me remember numbers uh with uh West Balls. Uh huh. Twice. Yep. Twice. Twice. The first time was tight. The second time it was like that's right. You know? <laughs> it's good shit. The way it's supposed to be. Yep. Like a Facebook comment of of infinite numbers, uh, Jason being like, "I'm gonna beat West Balls. <laughs> like, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go to Summit. That's what he needed and, to do. And it's gonna. It's. I'm gonna. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do okay. The, I'm going to beat West Balls. The yeah. crew battle. Yep. Yeah. The crew battle is high. He, he, uh, yeah. Yeah. Shoot at. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That shit was funny. Twitch chat mute was like, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> this guy Don't is matter. pretty cool. Uh. Yeah. But yeah, I'm. Uh, I'm sad I couldn't go, but uh. I had a I had a busy day. Uh, went went to some some shows in in Somerville and caught a flick with you, Michael. That's true. We went to see fucking. I went to the beach each, and then fucking. Uh, we went to see Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness. We did it was, it was okay. You gotta you gotta. We are we are Mar- Marvel fucking dumb we are Disney consumers. Cuck. Marvel yeah. consumers. Consume products. Eat popcorn. Disney, mm, Disney, Disney doesn't have Disney, enough money. Yum, they don't have enough money. Yum, they yum, need, they need more money. Delicioso. So, that was, yeah, that was fine. I'm going to give a mouse a blowjob. I just went over there. That's a rat. It's a little much for him. I don't think <laughs> I can fit. More mouse speed. Uh, Yeah. Tight. Here's something for you, Mike. Hit me with it. So before I left, um, before I left for Maryland, um, we, we, were, we were all, we went out. We're all we're all drinking, sure. And you knew you got you got you got a little, little Michael drunk, little 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 Michael drunk, little, little loose lips action. What is this? I'm I'm, I'm explaining a thing to you. Yeah, no, but you said Maryland uh, before Maryland. Oh, before you went to Maryland. Before I went to Maryland. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. We're hanging out. Mm-hmm. You get a little drunk. Get a little, little Michael loose lips. And you, and you go and you, you go you go Ryan Ryan you're gonna I tell you something but you're gonna you're gonna hate it. <laughs> you're gonna hate it. And I was like I think I know what this is. I was like wow. I was like okay. Damn. And we were on a you know table, our friends. Like I'm, I'm like, oh, well, it can't be that bad because we're in front of all our friends. Yeah. And they're like, mm-hmm. well, I don't know what he's gonna tell me right now, but like, God, what's it gonna be? Yeah, I know what this is. And he's like, well, I am. Uh, I had to mute your Instagram story. <laughs> As if I give a single fuck about it. What do you think about me? I know deep inside that I would care at all. I know deep inside you care. No, I do. You do. Because the thing about the thing about Instagram story that I like so much is that you don't give a shit. Is that no? It's the only like social media platform where I'm. It's not forced on anybody. That's a good point. You have to opt into it to see it. That is true. If it was my Mm. Twitter or my main Instagram, you would see my post all the time, and then you'd have to mute me because like you'd be like, I don't want to see Ryan post all this time. It's just a little bubble. If you don't click me on your top, it, I show up just there. less and less. Yeah, I don't even mm-hmm. have to. Other, I can just go past you or whatever. No, not like right out on the right side of your screen. Yeah. The real kicker is that uh, I've been taking sneak peeks at your Instagram stories. Yeah, I've seen. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen. Dude, they're, they're pretty I see who sees it, dude. They're, they're, they're pretty good. <laughs> yeah. It's got some good ones. You've stepped up your game. No, I, think, I think in. Realizing that I didn't enjoy your Instagram stories, no, you're you're like, 
fuck, I really am not putting out the A1 steak sauce content that no. my clown really just l- strives and looks for. And if Michael, who is a real funny, handsome guy. The real barometer for good yeah, guys. Yeah, who isn't yeah, enjoying yeah. it, then maybe it just needs to be... Maybe I need to put more of me. Which in once it. again, you only if you click on it, you see it. <laughs> and and not... the best part is if you, if you click on it and it's like one billion fucking gray squares, you can just click out of it and be like, no, I don't want to see that. Dude, I'm so good at just not like remembering how many bubbles I have till the person I don't want to see anymore. Yeah. And just getting out of there. Yeah. How what determines bailing. it? Is it how often you click on the, the guy? If you avoid their stories, they'll go away. Yeah. Well they they, they get pushed into the very end of your I don't look at Instagram stories ever. So I don't even know why I did that. I like yeah. doing some well, I don't know why you did that or why you told me <laughs> that you did I that. I just thought it would be something important. Because I thought <laughs> I thought maybe I didn't want to. I wanted to tell you because if you ever found out, maybe it would have hurt your feelings. Which, which also is insane that I would care at all. I feel like trust is important, and so I decided to come out and tell the truth. Uh, and how would he that find was, that out? He because he looks through all the names and he would. He you would, already have the perfect Michael's cover of I don't look at Instagram stories. <laughs> I <laughs> which, feel, you like. <laughs> It's and great like, because there are people that I'm like, no, and I just don't look at them. For Ryan, though, I was like, so you do look at Ugh! them. <laughs> and, I, I, and, I, and I occasionally, I check, I check them. No, I, and I, don't. I see who sees it. I, I'm like, oh, I, I, can, I can see who. They do give you the names. Yeah. They give you the full list. So. I don't know. I, know. I, if anything, I just thought it was funny. That's if the anything, answer. I was more blown away that the you answer. thought that would have any effect on me. I should whatsoever. stop telling people when I don't, what, I, what, I, what about their social media, what I feel about them, because nobody gives a shit. Except yeah. for Sarah. Told Sarah I have her muted on Twitter. She's like, "Why did you tell me that?" <laughs> it, is, it, is pretty, it is pretty rude to just tell us. Yeah, it, is. <laughs> it came up in conversation for some reason. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Whatever. Dude, you wild. have a great Instagram now, though. Story wise. Hey, am I am I, unmu- post am I unmuted? Uh, wow. Live. Maybe I do care. Maybe it's uh, all on, on the boy. Um. Anyway. Why'd you bring that up? Just cause. Oh, I thought it was funny. It is funny. No, it's cool. I, I enjoyed it. That was a funny, a funny Thank little you. chat. I don't know how our viewers felt about it. Ryan, but... no, it's funny. It's relatable. Yeah, yeah we, we all we all get Mike mute the soul on Instagram. Hey Instagram. viewers, you ever been on Holy social shit. media too? Young man's. Yeah, look, look at him. I know. I saw it. It's crazy. I didn't I see it. Ryan's yeah, that's my story. story. It's crazy. How... <laughs> I like that's... Ryan's story. I like keep it up. I don't give a shit. On, you posted on this lizard like maybe five times. I haven't. I feel like you have. First time. You wouldn't know you don't watch my story. Take things. <laughs> Clearly watches. This guy's crazy. Oh, wait. What? Oh, maybe I did unmute you. Nice. That's a W for Ryan. Um, anything else? <laughs> I'm going to sleep well tonight. <laughs> <laughs> Cozy. So you, you were clearly giving out the A1 steak sauce content then. Yeah. Yeah, because Michael must have been like, God, I got to tap back in. I think I, I, I think the drunk Michael, after he told me, he unmuted me. He, no. he, he felt so bad about Maybe it. Maybe I did. I don't think so. Though. He felt so bad. He, he, was, he, was, he was like, I really made Ryan sad today. And then he, <laughs> and Ryan's like, then he watched all my stories. <laughs> oh, big boss, a tiny dancer. You've been doing this thing recently where you sing really bad all the time. I'm on a highway. <laughs> <laughs> what do you uh, mean? <laughs> here. Oh, man. It's my guy, my man's. Yeah. What uh what a world. Oh fuck, I wanted after the Patty halftime show, I wanted to do the phrase. I forgot. It's too late. It is too late. Yeah. yeah. Questions? Are we doing that? Do we have more things? Uh, I don't think it's any questions. No, we're dooski. Uh oh, hey, wait. if you're out there in the wide world and you got questions for us, now's your time to drop them. Phil, any questions for us? No. Nope. <laughs> All right. I, I, I got a question for just, Phil. Oh, let's hear it. Sure. Phil, okay. where can they find you on the internet? Oh, God, let's go do that. Question. What a good question. You can find. You can. What are you doing, man? You can if you want. Are you on? Are you on loud mode? I got it. There we go. You can find Alston Melee what? at no we're talking about at you. Alston you. Melee on Twitter. You. you also subscribe to them on YouTube. It's Me, nice. I've just been pressing the buttons up here. Uh, I'm Reach Online. R E E C H Online on Twitter. Uh, a shit post on there and stuff like that. Thank you for reminding everybody out there. Wow. Oh, also, uploads. We're uploading all this shit starting Friday. Cool. Oh, we're yeah. a Friday cast now? Yeah. Hell yeah. Friday, Friday cast. That's at least for this week. Party cast. We have a little bit of a backlog. Yeah. Two episodes, but they're going to start Friday. 
Um, so if you missed the first two of this season, get ready for that. Yeah, and these all go on Spotify pretty quick after we record them. Yeah. So is that a question? Those are all there. There is a question from a question. Cable Knit. I know that guy. Ryan, was it you or Patty who was the Max Seal fan? All um, of the above. We have we have all of the above. Uh, what, what what when did that come up? Did I, we talk about Max Steel? Just a question. I, no, I love Max Steel. We've we've we we you know like we started the show there. There was a uh, we both like Max Steel. Even I've seen Max Steel. I don't even like Max Steel. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Funny. As we go to the shows Watch quite a bit. Just yeah, it's fun. Tight. It was a good show. We actually we ran into Max Steel the uh, the next morning at Twin Donut. Mm-hmm. Oh, last month at Prince Ayini. Oh yeah, Prince Daddy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't see that show. I didn't, I was uh, I think I was out of town at the at the time at the time. But um uh, yeah, Max Steel's Max Steel's good. Um uh, what's the one song? I like, but next to you is really good, and all their stuff is. They're great. Cool. And they're friends with uh, Chris. Chris is friends with them. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Who knows them enough? And like I said, some twin donuts. Come on, and twin fam. Wait, yeah, you're in come your on, shirt too. we're a twin donut. We like, love our our twin family. Ryan, where can the people find you? You find me at I don't give a shit on Twitter and my world famous Instagram stories. Thank you, Michael Allen. Yeah, they get the Michael Allen seal of approval. Yes, at least for now. We'll, we'll see so what he, happens. He'll let you know when he mutes me again. <laughs> if, it makes, if it means anything, I really like your Instagram stories. I watch them every day. That does mean something to me. You you put time into them. I, I do. Don't... Too much time. <laughs> <laughs> but I much shout into the void. Not trying to make you feel bad. No, it's, I mean, I, I agree. I co-sign. It's got good Instagram stories. Ted, where can they find you? <laughs> Nah, they can't. They can't. I know they, they, can't. Can't. they can't. They they could if they wanted to. I think I'm pumped to see these these pictures. As I said, uh, these fit pictures of uh, oh from oh, the oh, Indy yeah. 500. Yeah. Oh yeah, we'll definitely be taking some pictures. Okay, up here, I'm there. I'm so I'm so excited for you guys to kill it down there. Yeah. I might take this camera with me if I'm yeah. feeling feisty. I mean, is that another question? What's your thinking? camera? Yeah, that is the bomb. no. That's, that's just saying hi to Trey. Trey. Cypher, Cypher and Trey. Trey talking. Love that. Um, How's it going, out. Cypher? How's yep. it going, Trey? Cypher, have me on, have me on your show uh, sometime soon. I'll do it. I swear to God. Uh, bu- 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 what are we doing? <laughs> He's crazy. <laughs> what are we going to say? Michael, what about you? Oh, yeah. You can find me, Michael Ireland, at twitter.com forward slash cave lemon. Also, I started doing a stream recently. I'm probably going to keep doing it because it's fun to do. Uh, we'll see how long that lasts. But it's like I do a, I'm doing a gamer gauntlet on Twitch. I'm bad at games, and I got to beat a certain number in a row. And if I lose in any of them, I got to start over. It's funny. Well, what are the games? I do Overwatch 2, which I'm going to have to change because <laughs> the beta is over as of today, uh, into Valorant, into Fortnite, into Melee. Yeah. That's and, the routine. And you've gotten to Fortnite. I've gotten to Fortnite twice. I, I uh, lost on Overwatch once. That's the first attempt. Then, got to one, then went to Fortnite, lost. Then went to Fortnite again, lost. So I've yet to make it to Melee. Fortnite's going to be the hardest one. Just tight. Um, and I'm, it's fun to do, and I'm excited. I'm gonna make a little YouTube video. And you're not solo queuing. No, I mean I will, but uh, the first, I just wanted to ride with some homies because they wanted to play, and it's fun to do with boys. So that's what I did. So they can carry your ass. It is fun when you play video games with friends. With, with your friends, yeah. yeah. It's fun to hang out with friends. I, I find. I like doing it. Uh, I have some questions in now. Um, Cypher asks, Ted, will you be my Valentine? Uh huh. 2023. <laughs> So yeah, lot, lot, ahead. Lot, I like that. Yeah. I thought we were going to be Valentine. You really got to... Well, you got to beat to it. It's true. <laughs> He's a little early, but it's no, all right. Uh, you're a little I'm late. late. <laughs> yeah. You call dibs. Um, PJ asks Michael, okay. what's yeah. up with Michael Allen dodging poker voice chat? I don't dodge poker voice chat. Tra- tra- I'm going to have a stroke. Uh, the one night that I was playing poker with you, PJ, I was literally sitting in bed with on my iPad like a little boy, uh, <laughs> yeah. and I was like, I'm not gonna get up and get on my fucking microphone to play poker, and I flossed you for seventy five dollars. It's always the silent ones that floss. You fucking. Bitch well, and then I was on the other night with Patty, and I also fucking beat him out that night. And then last night I wasn't on, and I still made money. Get Classic fucked. Mike beating out Patty at night. I love beating out Patty at night. <laughs> it's my favorite thing to do. But I'm a voice chat guy now. I'm a voice chat guy. Get fucked, PJ. Fuck you. This stream, this this podcast is over. It is. It is pretty much over. 
Bye, everybody. Uh, maybe see you next week with a guest. Maybe two weeks from now because maybe that's the way it goes. I love you. I love you so much. All right, goodbye. Bye. Suicide. 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 I just want to kiss you, but I can't right now, so baby, kiss me.